Hey Cupcakes, so I am now home. I just had me some beef stew, well sort of like beef stew, and then I just got some mail and I wanted to go ahead and show y'all me like unboxing it for you. It's real, technically it's not even in a box, it's in a package. But uh, I ordered these from a shop on Instagram that I love that I've been following now for a while and it's planner goodies so let's just show without further ado so it came in this little cute bag with this little ribbon to tie it together and it is paper clips for my planner I've got um I got Halloween cupcake ones from this girl and then I also got NBC ones and then I got a zero um cozy from her but I got these recently for the winter time and then this is her little card oh she's doing a reward thing now collect five zebras and receive a ten dollar shop credit so her shop is mud pies and pigtails and I always forget what her name is because I never remember her saying it but I know what her shop is called so I got these which I've been eyeballing for a while they're the Christmas cupcakes so it's just a little reindeer and a snowman and they're really really cute and then her last live sale she's been doing ready to ship live sales every Thursday but this this Thursday will be her last one so I got these last week so I got this little one of polar bears kissing, which is super cute for the winter time. And then I got this little festive pink tree. And then I got this you and me little wood one that's like this very cute. I don't know if you consider that fabric or what, but it's very shiny. And I had to get this one for Valentine's Day. And then if not, uh, mine and Luke's anniversary because um we went to the lake together and put our names into a tree and i just thought that was was cute so that was everything i got so now now i needed to find a way of how to store them and um if y'all have any suggestions let me know in the comments because i have really only a washi tape dispenser holder and then other than that i don't really have any place to put them but i need to switch up my halloween ones with these now that it's clearly winter time so now i'm going to put these aside and we will do our advent calendar which today was the 13th so today was luke with his candy which he didn't eat 11 either <clears throat> He's just over there grinning at me. But today is number 13 in my advent calendar that I can open. So, number 13 is one across from the 12. And it is, I think this is Perry. No, it is not Perry. It is a giant white rabbit. All I saw was the blue, so I thought it was Perry. A giant white rabbit, and if none of y'all know, I'm a big Alice in Wonderland fan. Of course, my favorite character is Cheshire, but I love all the Alice in Wonderland characters. So, this little white rabbit and his little outfit, and then I think he has a little bow that goes on him. So let's unwrap him. Oh, did you see what mine was even for yesterday? No. Yesterday was. Uh, Dale. See? Yeah. Uh-huh. White rabbit actually kind of looks creepy. Okay, so here is a white rabbit with his little bow and his little bun tail. And yeah, can't wait to get Cheshire. I hope I get Cheshire at least in this. It shows him on here, so I might get him. Haven't got him yet. But this was White Rabbit. So that's our whole crew so far. 
And I'm going to go ahead and turn on the trees. I'm slacking pretty bad working all the time. I forget to ever turn these on. So now that tree is on. And then this tree is on now. Also, I went to the store earlier, <clears throat> had to pick up some things I needed, but I also, I wanted to buy one more movie for my dad because how his present box was, I had it, it was, it would fit like one more movie, and so I bought him this movie, which was the Kingdom of Heaven, and it has, it looks like Orlando Bloom, but I could be wrong, but I feel like it would be something that he would like, so I got it, and then, um, I have nothing for my niece on my other my other brother, his daughter, uh, for Christmas, so I had to buy her something, and then all I bought my nephew was books, besides my one nephew that I spoil crazy because he's the youngest and he's easy to buy for. So I bought her a doll. I got her Rapunzel, which Luke agreed with me that she had long hair, so she would have long hair. It would be fitting, so I got the little Rapunzel doll. And then I got this little set, which when I was younger, I loved these things. It's like little outfits that you can dress your Barbies in, and then they have little shoes, too. And a little purse. I loved getting these because my mom would sit there and buy me a uh, doll for any like special occasion, like birthdays and Christmas. But then she would buy me these outfits like every so often for the dolls, so they wouldn't just have one outfit. So... I bought this for her doll, and then since I only bought my nephew books, well technically I didn't even get to buy the books, I got them for free, so I bought him these little trucks. And then my sister-in-law, she was talking about getting a journal that she could color, and I saw they had this one, so I bought this one for her to go with her little picture frame. So That's what I just got recently. So now, like I said, I just got done eating, and then Luke is playing a, what is it, a storyline? A different storyline? He's playing an expansion on his game for a different character on there. And what else? Oh, Luke put this up yesterday while I was at work all day. So we had a little bear, which I think is adorable, that I bought a long time ago. It's just this little key holder, and it's little bears holding each other, And but it's like literally for one key. Well, then me and Luke met, and I have a lanyard for my car. He has a lanyard for his, well, he did have a lanyard designated for his truck. And then we had a lanyard that we just bought that he liked. And then he has his truck key that he doesn't have on the lanyard. So we have like three lanyards. And clearly they're not all going to fit on just one little hook. Well, we went to Goodwill that time together. And we bought, or he bought, this. Or I, did I buy it or you bought it? Oh. Well, anyway... It's kind of awkward how it's like this because this is technically windows, but we don't consider them windows because this house is really old and awkward and all that. But anyway, he nailed it up here. So it's got like these little shelves, I guess you consider them, even though they don't have a back to them. But if we wanted to, we could probably just put a cheap piece of wood on the back of it to make them shelves. And then see, they have just these three little hooks. So he puts his keys there and then mine goes right there and then his little truck key goes there. So... I came home to that last night, which was really nice, and then, trying to think if there's anything else to tell y'all. Hmm. I don't think so. I, uh, I've been just, this morning I did the same thing again where I woke up and then went to work and then worked until five and then all this happened so ooh, i have chocolate milk in the fridge 
I literally had a giant bowl of cereal this morning. I told Luke I had nothing for breakfast, and he went to the store and sat there and bought me waffles, and then I realized I had cereal still, so I ate the rest of my cereal. And then I had a giant glass of chocolate milk, didn't drink it because I was full, and then I got to work, had a tummy ache, and now I'm going to drink my chocolate milk. Do y'all like my cupcake cup? I bought this for like a dollar at H-E-B. Either I did or Luke's mom did. I remember her being with me and I saw it and she was like, you don't need it. And I was like, but I do need it because it's cupcakes. Speaking of cupcakes, babe, guess what I saw at Family Dollar just a minute ago? Please tell me it was a cupcake. It was. It was a cupcake pillow. And I literally took it off the shelf to buy it, and then I talked myself out of it like I do everything. If y'all don't know me personally, you can ask Luke. I talk myself out of everything, even if I actually need it. I will find a reason to where I don't need it. And it's a really bad thing about me that Luke has got on to me multiple times about and so, like, I saw the cupcake pillow, and I was like, I need it. It's cupcakes. No reason at all. I need it. And then I looked at how much it was for everything else I was getting Christmas-wise, and I was like, I'll just buy this, and I'll just come get the cupcake pillow later if they have it. Because the pillow was six bucks. And it's just the pillow. And I didn't want to spend six bucks. I would spend three on it, but not six. See, I'm like, I'm explaining to you why I talked myself out of it. But then, it's like, I just got paid. I honestly could have afforded a pillow that was only six dollars and it was a cupcake, but I didn't. And that is my problem. So. But. I love cupcakes and bears and I have for a long time. I have literally a shelf. Oh, well, it's technically Luke's shelf, but then I took over it with all the bears I have. His stuff's still on that shelf, but it's over populated with bears now. So, everything in the shelf is bears, except the top shelf is little cupcake candle holders my mom got me, and then I bought Num Noms and put them in each of the cupcakes, and then our family friend for my birthday bought me a cupcake doll. It's shaped like a cupcake, and then you unfold the, the silicone cupcake, and it turns into a, a little girl doll, and the cupcake part, like the, the topping on the cupcake right there. That is like her little hat. So. But uh, honestly if I would have to pick one or the other. It would be bears. But I love how cute cupcakes are too. Like the tree. Uh, last year my first tree I had. Which technically wasn't mine. It was my mom's. But my first tree I had at my brother's house. When I was staying at his. Because the room was so big and empty and echoey. Because it was the guest room. And I didn't know I was going to be living with them. I wanted to fill up the space, so I bought the tree, and it was my first tree, and so I could decorate it however I wanted, so I got a bunch of cupcake ornaments for it. And then it was bad because I would find more and more and more, but I wouldn't be the person that bought like multiple sweets, like like peppermints and, and cupcakes and suckers and all that stuff. No, like I just wanted cupcakes, and that was it. So my mom even bought me a cupcake ornament for the tree and then I bought a giant beautiful cupcake ornament and this was when I was working at Kmart I sit there and spoiled myself with like a ten dollar ornament and then uh, I met Luke around next year and then this year we bought more so now I have bears and cupcakes on the tree and I even told Luke that this year his tree the tree could be what he would want it and then I still will sit there and decorate it like that but it's okay, because we'll get our own place, and I'll get an even bigger tree, and then we can do it the way he wants it. And then the little trees can just be mine. Sound like a plan, babe? No. No? Oh, well. So you're still going to do it? We're still going to do it anyway. No, you're still going to do it. There's no weed in that. What do you mean? Decorating the tree, or? Yeah. Yeah, but the big tree is going to be yours. You say that. It is. Mm -hmm. It's going to have anything you want on it. 
I also saw a Kingdom Heart tree my friend had because he, he collects Kingdom Heart pins. And his wife did the tree for him and got the little um, domey characters, if y'all know what I'm talking about. It's like a, a character literally in a dome glass. Like it's like, like Beauty and the Beast, the rose, it's shaped like that. And she put all the ones that he got on the tree and like decorated them with like snow and stuff and then cut out little kingdom heart symbols and put the lights and put bulbs according to the colors of the game <laughs> which is blue and yellow and red and black technically and that the, all the colors mainly for the game no, but it looked awesome and i said i was going to steal that idea so and Luke already knows about it, so it's not really a spoiler or a surprise or anything. But I think it'd be cool to do. But anyway, now I'm just rambling to you guys, and it's been 16 minutes now. So I will talk to y'all in a little bit.